such an important series because we're being pressured as much as ever to choose between God and culture. To choose, will I obey God or will I not obey God? Listen, loved ones, more than ever, we are being tempted in some form to stop and say to God, but why God? But why? At the end of the day, we're going to see through proper theology, the only answer God needs to give is, because I said so. But we don't, we don't understand that phrase without a proper renewal of the mind and theology of God's word that causes us now to live by faith in submission to God's word. Let me just say this from the start too. This message today, without faith, goes nowhere. On some level, you need faith in Christ for the Holy Spirit to give you the ability to understand the things of the Spirit. But he can do that. But it needs faith 100%. Otherwise, it's like, yeah, whatever. What a bunch of hogwash and da 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 whatever. And the person doesn't, that happens all the time. But by faith, as God is moving, we say, yes, this is right. This is true. God has said so. And I believe in him. This is also why in this series, the first pillar of our church is proclaiming the authority of God's word. Hope you know this if you're part of our church. First pillar. Proclaiming the authority, not just proclaiming God's word, proclaiming the authority of God's word because that is our authority for anything that we're seeking to do for the Lord without apology. Proclaiming the authority of God's word without apology. 